What's good? It's your boy One coming at you once again. Okay, back with another review. It's been a long time since I did one of these, but thanks to the fan request, I asked you guys in my last video if you wanted to see a review on this zombie, so here we go. This is my uh, escaped zombie from my new zombie series, The Deadline, which I'm hoping to bring more than just one six figures, but you know, busts and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, <laughs> um, this is the third figure from that line. Uh, the first one did very well on eBay. If you guys are following me in any way, you would have seen that. I I'll do a slideshow because I no longer have that figure, so I'll do a uh, slideshow for those of you who haven't seen it. Very cool piece, and I also did a second one, but I sold outside of eBay. But uh, this is the third one right here, and I'm very happy with how it turned out. Um, I mean, he's just put this right here. I just he he was very fun. I just took my time. This was actually made from a Jack Sparrow uh, True Type Slim body, and uh, as you can see, I did a lot. Like just, I sculpted over almost everything. I took out the uh, little joints, uh, this little shoulder, like so pivots in and out. I took all that out. Have his arms kind of going back, um, and everything has been sculpted. As you can see, the. Uh, you know, like the veins and stuff, texture and everything. I didn't really sculpt too much on the forearms because this, this version is like the Thriller version. And it comes, you know, with veins. Already. I did sculpt like, you know, like little rotted holes in it and everything. Like so. I, obviously, I had to keep these joints in there, but that's okay. But as you can see, there's just like crazy like details and lines and sculpts in the sculpt. It's just nipples <laughs> I had fun sculpting those but yeah man ball jointed head I, I, that's the future man I, I'm gonna try and do more of my sculpts ball jointed on, on everything just gives a, a more of a realism a more realism to it to me if you could do it where it blends right I mean I, that could also work against you you know but um yeah, I have his guts out. So, like, it, it's a lot more glossy than it appears on camera for some reason, but whatever. Uh, and you can see the thick blood dripping from his mouth. Look at that shit. His tongue kind of... That's his tongue. Maybe I should lighten that up now that I look at it. But I don't know. This, this fucking sunlight just drowns all the details out, but that's okay. Yeah, I, I, I really had fun making this one because he has, he's, although he is a obvious carnivore <laughs> and just he's angry, but you can still see there's a sympathetic look in his eyes that kind of make you feel sorry for him, which that's the kind of look I like, you know, although I do like the fucking angry in your face zombie, you can see all the veins and stuff, dripping on his pants of blood, there's no dick on it, I didn't sculpt a dick, so... I have done that before in the past. Some of you guys who own my earlier custom works might work might know about that. Uh, it's a full sculpt. There's actually sculpt underneath here. Uh, you know, I wasn't too lazy on this guy. It, go, it goes down even further, but I'm not. You know, it's covered up just to protect myself from getting AIDS. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, protect myself as far as like you know, I I, I wanted to sculpt the legs out. Didn't strategically plan where I wanted to put every hole, so I just sculpted it and wherever I felt like putting the holes in the pants it's gonna be there you know there's gonna be some sculpt there painted work there so uh, even the hands man I, I really took my time and painting them and the nail color let's get some zoom in fucking sick I, and these these are real metal shackles I actually got these off of a, a sideshow like like fucking uh, Frankenstein figure very happy this is like because, alright, I, I did plan on originally making him kind of like a tribute to Bub from Day of the Dead because I'm a fucking, you know, Day of the Dead fan. So I wanted to do something a little more, like give him some headphones and a gun hand with a gun, you know, hand, ah, a hand with a gun, you know what I'm saying? Little things like that, little nods to him, but, uh, you know, I decided not to. I, I loved the full body sculpt. I'll give you a shot of the back. Um, and I just wanted to show it off more and it just seemed less bubbish, <laughs> if I can say that, I don't know more uh, you know work the whole back everything was sculpted even the um, as you can see like see these joints right like the, I left the midsection joint let's see I might be setting myself up it works but uh, 
you know, I, again, you know, see, it's it's all underneath there. There's all it's, it goes it extends all the way. And I got the rigor mortis and all that setting in, so you do see the bruising and discoloration in his body. I went with a yellow tone. I mean, th this this is the crazy part because I, I don't sketch anything out before I sculpt. I just freestyle it wherever it takes me, which is to me the funnest thing ever because I don't think a lot of time I I, I can't show off what I can do and when I do something original I, I can just do whatever I want that's fun and show off you know some skills man I got some skills baby you know <laughs> but um yeah so the detail goes all the way around the skin tone I mean everything man it's just what will I do I wanted to make him black like I mean not like a black dude but like just black like just tar color like you know black as could be maybe some gray um you know uh highlights on there and stuff like that which and that might happen sometime in the future i think he would have looked pretty sick like that with just like the blood dripping like bright red blood dripping but we'll see you know if anybody wants to use that idea and again you know the deadline is my series but um i would like to collab with some other artists and as far and not even necessarily collab i mean we could also work together on a zombie or you guys just you know, do a zombie up, and you know, if that shit's hot, you know what I mean, we'll, we'll put it underneath the deadline name, it'll blow up, and we'll all have a piece when it does, you know what I'm saying, <clears throat> but yeah, but I got, I got, I got killer ideas, guys, I got so many more ideas, um, which I hope to accomplish, he's barefoot right here, you know, barefoot, kept it simple, get out, I'm in my kid's room right now, I just kicked him out of their own room, um, let me finish up, this is always gonna happen, guys, <laughs> Um, I also thought, hey, maybe I should add this dress on him. Make him like a princess army zombie. I, I don't... Okay, that's a joke. This is my daughter's, obviously. It's not mine. It's not for a custom project, guys. Um, <laughs> or was I? But yeah, and you know, like when I do my own stuff like this, you know, it, it feels good to just create, man. So, his mouth is... Oh, my phone's getting hot. So yeah, this is my Escape Zombie from the Deadline series, One Six Zombie series, from One's Customs. Um, lots of little blood splatter all over his arms. Very fun, man. I'm going to be doing more, and um, stay tuned in the future. Thank you to all my subscribers and friends, and uh, you know, fans of the work. Uh, I appreciate everybody, you know what I'm saying, the views, you know, and the videos, and the comments, it just, it, it feels fucking great, man, I, I hate it when I'm not on, on YouTube now, you know what I mean, I'm gonna just stay on YouTube, and I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm just, I'm just gonna be naked, <laughs> I'm kidding, alright, um, you know what I mean, much love to everybody, this is, uh, again, my custom 1-6 zombie, I'll be doing a slideshow, actually, you know what, I'll probably do a slideshow, because I've done, like, lots of different pieces that no one's seen, you know what I mean, whether it sells outside of eBay, or, or even on eBay that people just don't know about, uh, so I'll keep you guys posted, and, uh, this is my 1-6 zombie again, for the fucking 10th time, <laughs> peace, bitches, just kidding, bye.